Hello, 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 Aquarius. Aquarius, we are a, we are a, chicka, 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 Aquarius, we are a. <laughs> we are, we is, we will always be. All right, this is for Aquarius in love let's see what is coming your way uh please give this video a thumbs up to support this channel please pretty please don't make me get on my knees beg you please okay uh this is for the beginning energies of uh october okay the beginning of october all right aquarius What's coming to Aquarius in love? What messages do we have for Aquarius in love? Aquario, Aquario in love. What's coming? Aquarius. Ooh, 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 ooh. Aquarius in love. What's coming? Okay. Something fall out already. Ooh, oh, definitely did. You have a magnetic attraction it's coming to Aquarius in love. So you definitely have some kind of magnetic attraction with somebody. Uh, wow, this is interesting. You have fear. And roll the dice. Take a chance. Take a leap of faith. Okay. So you feel very attracted and you feel a strong pull to this person, Aquarius. Remember, anything I'm saying here can be vice versa for you and this person. You feel a strong pull in everything with this person, but you're also very afraid. Okay, let's find out what the heck you are afraid of, Aquarius. Um, <laughs> what are we not afraid of at this point? We just don't want a nasty ring, unless it's in that way. All right, what's coming to Aquarius in love? But you have a wedding, marriage forever, the one in union social media. Okay, so it is looking like this person um, could be the one for you, Aquarius, even though you're so afraid. Now, we do have the Six of Wands that came out while I was shuffling in the beginning. What's coming? Sorry, the Six of Swords. What's coming to Aquarius in love? Tell me more. I feel like you're leaving something that was really mentally taxing on you, Aquarius. Um... You know, you went through a really defeating situation. Five of Swords reverse and a Six of Swords. You may have been dealing with another air sign um, or whatever. But I feel like you're slowly but surely healing your... your um, Because I do feel like you've walked away from someone that made you feel really defeated and hurt. Uh, some of you maybe... It was like a, ter a bad breakup. Um a messy divorce or whatever you know perhaps this person really did a number on you this the five of swords is no joke okay five of swords individuals are incredibly selfish um and they just don't give a fuck who it bothers who it hurts it's all about them okay they always feel like they have something to prove or they want to one up you so um that being said aquarius you may have experienced something like that in the past recent past or whatever and maybe you're just kind of like, even though you're healing from it, it's like you're worried about getting into another relationship or just having love again. You know what I'm trying to say? Okay. But it does feel like you're trying to release your baggage here. Okay. But it's not going to be an overnight thing, obviously. But I do see you definitely successfully doing that. Okay. Um, bottom of the deck is the two of cups. I feel like you're definitely moving towards your happiness here. You're moving towards uh, emotional fulfillment, a healthy relationship, okay? That's what you're moving towards. And maybe you're just not used to um, a healthy relationship at this point. Because it seems like everyone always has some kind of fucking agenda. And you're like, look, I don't want to be taken advantage of again. I don't want to put my heart on the line and trust somebody again. And have this shit happen again. Now, obviously, I mean, you'll never know until you try it, right? Okay. You'll just never know. It's coming to Aquarius in love. So you have a lot of trust issues. I'm not even going to lie to you. You're just, you're kind of fed up here. Two of Cups just flew out. 
I feel like there's either someone around you or there will be somebody around you coming towards you. Okay. That is, um, definitely resonating with you. I think you, you have mutual feelings for this person. You know, the, the feelings are strong on both ends, um, and whatnot. And you definitely could see a pick a future with them, but I feel like you just, you're afraid of this all not working out. You're afraid of this being too good to be true. Okay. Because you've been so fucked up. You've been so bruised. Okay. Um, and I don't feel like this person in particular has done anything to make you feel this way. I just think it's whatever you went through in the past with somebody here. Okay. But I feel like this, this person here, um, they're willing to take it as slow as you want. Could be a Virgo, could be a Taurus. Okay. But they want to prove to you with their actions every day that they're committed to you and that they're not going to hurt you. Okay. You're afraid of that. They know that. So I feel like this person is going to do their best to show you consistency and show you within their actions that this is not that Aquarius. Okay. You can actually trust me. Okay. But it's easier said than done. Okay. So I do feel like there's, you know, they're, they're willing to be incredibly patient with you. Um, because I feel like, yeah, you see, you get into your head and overthinking and all that stuff and you don't want to end up pushing this person away. Okay. Some of you, maybe you already kind of did, but they know that and you guys are coming back together here. Um, or vice versa, your person could have some trust issues here. It's all about less talk and more action in this situation at this point. That's all it's about. The tower. I feel like you're going to be very shocked to find out that this is actually your person. And they are not going to do what you think they're going to do to you. That's the thing. Um, this is going to turn out better than you even um, expected, Aquarius. Ten of Cups again. Okay, the Knight of Cups. I think this person is literally making all kinds of efforts to reassure you, to let you know that it's okay. You know, you're going to be okay. I'm not here to do this. I'm not here to do that. Yeah. Like, I feel like this person is trying to nurture your heart. Knight of Cups and the Three of Swords. This person is willing to assure you every day. And they're going to continue to do that until you get it in your head that they're not here to harm you. Oh, that's so sweet. I'm sorry. This uh, reading kind of makes me want to cry. I just feel like this person is so caring. Okay, they're delicate with your heart. They're delicate. They know your heart is delicate. That your heart is safe with me. Okay? Um, Empress being at the bottom of the deck, like this person's intentions are, are pure. Okay? It could be obviously hard to believe, hard to whatever, but uh, that's the truth. All right. And again, I don't feel like this is that past energy. I feel like this is someone else. Um, okay. This is someone else. Two of cups yeah they don't want to lose you and i feel like this person um they just want to hold you give you kisses and just give you that security and knowing that they're not going anywhere and that not they're not going to do that okay yep it's almost like this person is trying to create a safe space for you that's exactly what they're doing here. Could be a Sagittarius or an Aries. Um, I feel, yep, the, the Emperor. They're trying to reassure you that they ain't going nowhere.
you're overly suspicious of this person and getting hurt. That's what you're, you're suspicious about. Yeah, you don't trust shit. You don't trust anything as far as you can see it, okay? So it's going to take some time, some real deal convincing for this, for you to really get around uh, out of your, you know, out of these trust issues. But I feel like it's doable. This person is going to make sure, you look, don't drop the ball. Continue to be consistent. Don't make promises where you don't keep them. Be a woman or a man of your word, okay? Little white lies, stuff like that ain't going to work, Okay? point blank period those are all the ways that we build trust with someone okay keeping communication open being a man woman of your word if you say you're gonna do this do it okay don't just make promises that you don't keep all these things i feel like you're really traumatized based on the past what you've experienced okay But this is not that. This is, I don't feel like this is that at all. You know, this person does want a union with you. Soulmate energy. So that is the obstacle here. That fear. Shy withholding. But it's saying it is true love communication. This person may even, yeah, you're being very discerning. Very discerning. Person may even get you something, okay? Just wanting to just throw that out there. Someone's definitely courting you for sure. You also have destiny, luck, chance, and it's meant to be. Wow. Okay. Okay, Aquarius. It's not too good to be true, honey. Okay, it, it is not too good to be true, honey. This is what you're moving towards. You are moving towards love. The real deal. Okay, Aquarius. Uh, let's roll the dice. Who is this person in love for Aquarius, please? Aquarius. You have another Aquarius. Sagittarius, Capricorn, Scorpio, who is this person for Aquarius? And um, if this does happen to be someone that you have a history with, it's up to you whether you're going to trust this freak again or not. Um, I feel like they do have good intentions, but it's up to you, okay? Gemini, Capricorn again. Cancer, Libra, Leo, Scorpio, who's this person for Aquarius, Aquarius, all the same signs basically coming out. All the same signs are coming out, literally. Virgo. Taurus. Two more. This is the same signs. <laughs> this is hilarious. I say Pisces already. Okay, so it landed on Aries. Sun, moon, rising, or Venus. Anyway, um, all right, cool. 
So, love you all. Talk to you soon.